This segment is sponsored by Virginia Museum of Fine Arts. Man Ray, the Paris Years. It's the newest photography exhibit at the Virginia Museum of Fine Arts. And I am here this morning with Madeline Dugan, exhibition research assistant and a student at Virginia Commonwealth University. Good morning. Good morning. It is a pleasure to be with you. This is such an exciting place and such a unique exhibit. So tell us a bit about Man Ray, the man. Man Ray was an American artist and he had begun his career in painting, but by the time our show is set, he was in Paris and he was focusing on photography. Our show specifically will show you the portrait photography that he took in Paris at that time. Yeah, and as you've been telling me since we've been here, he did quite a few things. He was quite the man, but this exhibit is really focused on those beautiful portraits that he brought to life, featured in magazines and all sorts of works of art. So what we see within the exhibit are several themes that you have so eloquently brought to life, and one of them is the modern woman. So can you talk about what the modern woman is, especially within the exhibit? Modern women were self-assured, independent, and career-oriented. What you'll see in our galleries are women with bobbed haircuts, they wore men's clothes, and they smoked in public, which had been scandalous in the years prior, but after the World War I, they had begun to really erase the sexual differences that they had before with their male counterparts, and instead they wanted to be equal to them. And he was really specific about capturing the essence of the modern woman. How do we see that come to life in his portraits? Man Ray's portraits provided all these women an empowering space for them to really show and present themselves how they wanted to be seen. Yeah, and you have a few here that you've been telling me about. The first, just over behind you with Lee Miller. So can you tell us a bit about what she did? Yeah, so Lee Miller and Berenice Abbott, who you will also see, were both Man Ray's studio assistants at separate times. And like many modern women, they were career oriented and they did not want to be held down by their male teachers. So they both eventually left him to start their own studio practices and were both very successful. Beautiful. And the stories that are really shown throughout the gallery are incredible. Not only are they stories on the walls, but there's some conversations and some events that you'll be having here at the museum. What can we expect in the month of December? Yeah, on December 8th, we will be having a community discussion focusing on the modern women then and now. Beautiful. Well, it is such an exciting place to be. If we want to be here for the exhibit or for the events, how do we take advantage? If you would like to register for an event or get tickets, you can visit our website at www.vmfa.museum. Excellent. Well, thank you for being with us. If you have not gotten your tickets for the Virginia Museum of Fine Arts, The Man Ray, The Paris Years, please go to our website, wtvr.com slash vtm to learn more. The Virginia Museum of Fine Arts, VMFA, is located at 200 North Arthur Ashe Boulevard right here in Richmond. The photography exhibition, Man Ray, The Paris Years, kicked off on October 30th and runs through February 21st of 2022. For more information, you can call the team 804-340-1400 or visit online vmfa.museum. Find out more on Facebook.com slash MyVMFA, on Twitter.com slash VMFA, and Instagram.com slash VMFA Museum. Stay tuned. We'll be right back. <laughs>